Why, hello everybody, and welcome to another mod review. Today we will be covering the fabulous, amazing, brilliant hose mod. Now I know it's quite a mouthful, but uh, that's pretty much the hardest part of the mod to get down. Uh, once we get into it, you will see that the crafting recipes are not too difficult, and they add uh, only five items, but these items are a lot of fun to play with, I can promise you that. Let's go ahead and check out the first one. Now this one is called Mr. Ho. It's made with a magenta dye, a lime dye, a diamond, and a bow, all surrounding a golden hose. Oh, now, Mr. Ho is very helpful to us, uh, very, very friendly. Uh, as you can see, uh, there he fires arrows. Now, I don't know if you can see him over there, but you can clearly see the arrow animation going up and to the left. Now, that's a little bug that has going on right now, but you can see clearly those arrows are hitting their mark. Um, no problem, and they do quite a bit of damage. Uh, I don't know if it's a one-hit kill all the time, but I know it is. Um, they're, they're very powerful. Very powerful arrows going out. Uh, so that is very awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and check out the next one. Now the next one is one that I wanted to hold off on. I won't show you what it does, but I'll show you how to make it right away. Uh, this is called the Mean Hole. Now the Mean Hole is made out of diamond, iron ingot, oak planks, wool, and a bow. Now, well, like I said, we're going to go ahead and leave that guy until a little bit later. Uh, this next hoe is called the Hoe of Doom. Now, this is made, it's, it's obviously getting a little bit more expensive, but that's to be expected once we get up higher on the scale. Now, this one's made from an iron ingot, a gold ingot, diamond, flint and steel, all surrounding an iron hoe. Now, let's go ahead and take this guy out, um, and we'll go for a walk here because we don't really want to ruin anything that we have set up over there. So let's go ahead and go by these sheep, and you will hear a, a very familiar noise when I right-click here. It is lightning, and you, as you can see, the lightning strike. Sometimes you don't see the lightning strike, but um, whenever you right-click with the hoe, and it's not on the ground, clearly, um, because that will just hoe the ground, but you can right-click and lightning. And so this is a way to make zombie pigmen if you want to just farm zombie pigmen, I guess. Um, you can do that, and you can get gold from them, or whatever you really want to do with the uh, with the hoe. I'm not sure if you take damage in survival. Actually, let's go ahead and, go ahead and try that um, real quick. Let me just go ahead and put myself into game mode S for you guys, and we'll see what happens. Okay, so you do take a little bit of damage, so you got to be a little bit careful about that. Uh, let me just go ahead and get back into creative, and let's get back up to the platform. Um, now, the next one is, I believe, called the Ultimate Ho. Um, yes, it is the Ultimate Ho. Now, this one is made with two emeralds, um, iron ingot, gold ingot, diamond, and two sticks. Now, it looks like this. So, let's go ahead and take this guy out. Now, I, I want to point you towards the, the, to the, to the sun in the sky. Now, normally, uh, I don't know if you know this, but I turn off daylight tick, so we're not getting a cycle of times while I'm working in the mod world, just so you guys don't have me accidentally run into the night, and then I have to quick edit and set it to day or something like that, unless the mod obviously needs us to be in the nighttime. Uh, otherwise, we stay right here. Now, you should notice that the ultimate hoe does two things. Let me go ahead and get these arrows on my inventory first. Oh, and speaking of things that are not supposed to happen during mod showcases, we have a nice rainy day, and we can't see the sun anymore, so let me go ahead and take care of that. Because what would be a mod review without an interruption, am I right? So let's go ahead and have that clear up, and once it does, I'll go ahead and show you what this guy does. Now, obviously, he holds the ground, yeah, very clearly, so let's go ahead and get rid of that before we forget about it. And you can see, obviously, it was wet, uh, wet ground uh, instantly, instead of having to wait for um, it, it to be saturated with water. Now, let's go ahead and right-click him, and we'll see what happens. Now, you'll see that the sun clearly shot down. Uh, that means that it is now a new day, because when I when I have the time usually set, I'll show you guys. Uh, if I do time set day, uh, there you go. That's the normal time that it sets, and then the sun would obviously go over our head like that. Uh, so it sets it earlier to what the uh, what the time set day command will do. So it's basically like sleeping in a bed without needing to sleep in a bed. You just right-click on the hoe. Now, you also see that something else popped up in my inventory, and that is cake. Now, we can go ahead and eat cake, obviously. You guys know uh, everything about cake. Now, this happens every single time you use the ultimate hoe. And I believe that I I'm not 100% sure on this. We're going to go ahead and test it. That it doesn't really take away... Um the, yeah, it does. Okay, that's good. At least it's fair because it takes away the durability when, you know, whenever you right-click it. You can see that the durability has already gone down um, with me right-clicking it. So it's kind of fair, uh, but it's 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 emergency cake, I guess. You could carry it with you if, you if you're running low on food and you just, you just go ahead and eat off the ultimate hoe, I guess, huh? Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and get into the last thing. Now, it's kind of a hoe. You can tell that it's, it's not really in the hoe shape. Uh, it is a gun, and uh, this is how you make it. You make a piston, three diamonds in this shape, and then we go ahead and add a flint and steel, gold ingot, and an ender pearl. Now, this one is supposed to be called the Gun of Ho Hoingtons, um, which is a name, obviously, the Gun of Hoingtons. Now, let's go ahead and fly over here a little bit, and uh, we'll take a few shots of the Gun of Hoingtons. Now, I'm not sure if it acts as a hoe. No, it doesn't. It just, okay. 
Anyway, so clearly it shoots flaming, exploding arrows, um, which is pretty awesome. I'm not going to lie. Uh, very, very cool. Um, but it's not a hoe. But it's very cool. I mean, it's a cool gun that gets added, uh, and and it's it's I don't know. It's got its features, I guess. If you want to blow up an area really quick, and you don't really care about things near it, um, let's go ahead and check out the last one, the one that I held out on for you guys, the mean hoe. Now, the mean hoe is the, there's a reason I, I left it out. Uh, it is because we will come on over here. A um, little bit further away from from where we just had been. I don't really want to stop here. Um, this looks about good. We'll, we'll stop right here, um, and I'll show you guys this. Now, this is the mean hoe. Clearly, um, very very cool. Let's go ahead and right click, and we'll see what happens. Now, two things should happen. One, there should be an explosion on us that launches us up in the air, and two, we get two giants. Now, usually the problem with this so far I've experienced. Uh, let's go ahead and grab a diamond sword so we can go ahead and take out this guy. Um, the problem is is that one of them is right. Like if you can look up in the top left corner, you'll see my damage indicators, and one of them just keeps spawning himself in and out. Now you see how that's fl flickering. I believe that's what that means. So we can go ahead and kill this guy right so we can go ahead and take care of him no problem um, but the problem comes when we have this other guy that keeps spawning in and out uh, and he just kind of stays there so I think that's kind of a, a bug in the mod right now I'm sure obviously it's being worked on as we speak the, the mod is very early on that's why there's not many items and things like that um, but so all we need to do is we'll just save and quit the title We'll go back in and we will open up the world and it goes away uh, very easily. I'm not sure if it can deal damage to you if you don't do that, uh, but it's just something to keep in mind. And I don't know why you would use it. I guess if you wanted to launch yourself in the air for fun with the mean hoe, but I would suggest not, not building it. Um, yeah, and so that is the fabulous, amazing, brilliant hose mod created by, I believe, Jack72389. Uh, you can go ahead and find the link for it in the description down below. Uh, if you're new to the channel, don't be afraid to hit that subscribe button. And if you like the video, remember to hit that like button. I'll see you guys later. Um, have a great day.